In this problem, this motorcycle travels along this curved path with a constant radius of 300 meter. It starts at point A and it travels to point B. Therefore, it has traveled a quarter of a full circle. And its tangential acceleration is given as a function of s, the displacement from point A along this curved path. And its speed at point A is 25 meter per second. We need to determine the magnitude of its acceleration when it has passes past uh, point B. So in order to determine its total acceleration, we know that acceleration has two components a t tangential and a n. And right now we do not know either one of them. We can evaluate a t based on s at point b. So because at point b this motorcycle has traveled a quarter of the uh, full circle, therefore at point b We can say that SB equals to one quarter of a two pi r, which is simply one half times pi times r, which is the radius, and that equals to 471.2 meter. Therefore, a t equals to negative 0.001 times s at that point sb and that equals to negative 0.001 multiplied by this value right here so that is going to be negative 0.4712 in the unit of meter per second squared so the next thing we need to know is a n and a n the magnitude equals to v squared over rho. Rho is a constant 300 meter. This v right here has to be specific. It has to be vb, the speed at point b. And we are only given the speed va at point a. va equals to 25 meter per second. Therefore, we need to apply one of the three kinematic equations along the path, again, along the path, we have v equals to ds dt, and then a t equals to dv dt, and lastly, a t ds equals to v dv. In this case, we have a t as a function of s, and we need to find v. Therefore, we're going to use the third equation. Therefore, a t is negative 0.001 s d s equals to v d v integrate on both sides at the initial uh, point point a s equals to zero the final point point b s equals to 471.2 and then v is integrated from the initial v of 25 to VB and VB is what we need to know and this equals to 1 half V squared evaluated from 25 to VB so the right hand side equals to 1 half VB squared minus 25 squared the right hand side equals to The integration of this part right here e equals to negative 0.001 times 1 half s squared integrated from 0 to 471.242. And that equals to negative 11, 111.03. So this value right here equals to this. Therefore, we have one equation with only one unknown, which is VB. So from there, we can solve for VB. That VB equals to 20.07 meter per second. 
and that as a result, a n equals to vb squared, so 20.07 squared, over the constant radius of curvature 300, and that equals to 1.343 in the unit of meter per second squared. Therefore, as a result, a equals to the square root of a t squared plus a n squared, which is um, a t is negative 0.4712, a n is 1.343. As a result, a equals to 1.42 meter per second squared.